Hey guys, I am headed to that train that had the electronic expansion valve um, when I did the last repair, replacing the um, pressure transducer. Um, I wasn't sure the charge was right. Um, I had not changed in anything and previously I had waited in, but the customer called and said it was making a funny noise and that it wasn't heat. And I still have not built anything for this job. So let's go check on it and see what's going on. Here we go. All right, when I got here, I did notice it looks like there's a little bit of oil right here. Maybe take off these plastic caps. Maybe down here too. All right, that was on high. I'm gonna check on low. I'm still getting three bars on low. Four bars on low. I'm gonna to try to show the right way to do this. This is a Schrader Core Removal Tool by Appion. I've got it kind of tight right now, but what you need to do is loosen that up. Not completely, but loosen it up. And then, you know what? I've had just a little bit of trouble with this. With it not grabbing my Schrader core. And um, I've got A magnetizing tool here I don't know if that helps but we sure gonna try it all right push in while you turn When you hear it clicking like that, all the threads are completely backed out. Turn it while you pull this out. You got to get past the O-ring right there. And the reason I backed off the threads earlier is because that O-ring can compress and keep this center from coming out. Let's see how I did. Nope. <laughs> no, it is not easy. To get that out. I'm going to try one more time. Go back in. All right, I know I'm um, I'm over the Schrader core now. Let's try again. Nope. That got it out. All right. 
push back in threads are starting all right it's as tight as I want it there we go let that air out for a little bit gonna do the next one Me dijo que estaba haciendo ruidos. The contactors, the contactors making a little bit of noise. That contactor sounds loud. Contactor sounds loud. That's what I'm hearing. Yeah, that's, and that's what it was. But it was a lot louder. Because when I come out of the house before, I can hear it. It's not a true superheat. It's just a suction line temperature. It's running in heat. All right, this is just the contactor making noises. So we're gonna go ahead and replace that. <clears throat> What's that? I said maybe two of them. I mean, I thought maybe that's what would cause it, but I mean, I wanted to make sure before I called, give it enough time to make sure this thing, you know, went through cycle, see how it was going to act. You know, I didn't want to just call you like, hey, you're going to rule. I think it ain't bad. You know, it's been, what, a week and a half or so? Yeah. I can pretty much wire these by just yank all the wires and start over but I like to do it this way one wire at a time because it just virtually eliminates making a mistake if you do it that way Pistons? Yeah. Oh so my. So you had to take it completely back apart. Yeah. Had to pull the piston back out, put them, you know, orient them so they're not, you know, around each other. Put them back in. I was like, ah, man, I'm just. It's like little things you just kind of forget. Or well, don't. Procedure. Well, don't feel bad. Sometimes. I'll go down the road, head heading somewhere, mm -hmm. and I'm so used to going to my supply houses that I'll completely forget where I was going and start heading to a supply house. And I got to stop and think, 
Okay, where was I going? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm serious. <laughs> So do you use your Spanish much? Um I do more now that I um started my channel in Spanish. But I'll be honest, it it really hadn't helped me much. I think that contact pulled in right away. A lot quieter. That's how it should sound. Mm -hmm. We're moving a couple of trees, like at night, kind of cool, and then come up a couple of trees in the morning. And normally it keeps up pretty good. Usually I go over there and walk in front of my sink in the kitchen. Okay, that's where I get the bed. Well, it was not low on Freon, and uh, and the contactor was the source of my noise. Turned out to be an easy one. Now I can bill out on that whole job. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you on the next one.